Hello everyone, it is Thursday, November 21st. I'm Natalie Pozo with your news to go. Riviera Beach City leaders met for the first time since a report was released. That report accusing employees of trying to hide E. coli found in drinking water. City officials did not address that report during the meeting, but the mayor did call for the city manager, who's not directly mentioned in that report, to be fired. That's because he is who the head of the utility district would report to. A meeting is expected in the future. The Martin County Sheriff's Office announcing the arrest of Aaron Hawkins, who just ran for State Senate District 31 on the Treasure Coast. Sheriff William Snyder says Hawkins was, was booked into the Martin County Jail Tuesday night on drug charges. He lost the Senate seat to incumbent Gail Harrell. A new program helping to protect Florida condos from storms has already reached capacity this just one week after it launched. The My Safe Florida Condo Pilot Program would have helped condo associations strengthen their properties against hurricanes. The pilot program offers free inspections and grant funding for wind mitigation improvements. There's also no word when or if the program could extend. Sandra. All right, weather-wise, we're going to see daytime highs today here in the 70s, somewhere about 76 degrees or so. Brisk northwest winds, that's ushering in the coldest air of the season, which will hit tonight as we dive down into the 40s. That's what you'll wake up to tomorrow morning. Have a good one.